Hey there, crafty friends. It's me, Nicole, and I am here with a Tamu haul for dollhouses. I'm super excited to show you what I got from Tamu. It was the first time I ordered. I got a 30% off coupon and free shipping, so my whole haul came to $25. Um, it got here, too, in less than three weeks. I was pretty shocked and very happy about that. For reference, these are the sizes of the dolls uh, that I'll be talking about. Some items are super small and would work well with a 124 scale, such as the Calico Critters. Some of the items are 112 and would work better with like a Chelsea doll. This is a six inch doll. This is like the typical size that most people make dollhouses for. And then we've got your 1-6 action figure or Barbie doll, which is more like uh, an 11 inch doll. And then you have your odd size doll, like this one here. This is a handmade Wednesday doll. She's only six inches tall, but she's super wide. So 112 isn't going to work for her. And uh, 1 6 works in width, but not in height. So for her, almost everything I, I am making in her house has to be handmade. Okay, so let's start by going through the 1 6 size. So we're talking Barbie doll size. Um, this is a rice cooker and it's so stinking cute. It's adorable. The lid comes off and it even came with like a little scooper. This definitely works for Barbie one six size for reference, right? That is not a Barbie at Spider-Man, but I have boys, so that's the best we can do right now. <laughs> this is the rice cooker. It could be used in a 112 on the counter. I mean, you could some crock pots are like huge. So again, some of this stuff is pretty versatile for both sizes. In addition to the rice cooker, I got this adorable coffee pot. This comes out. It looks so real. I love it. And this blender. And they all kind of go together. Each item was $2 or less. It's interesting because I saw these same items on Etsy for a lot more. Um, all right, so these are a win. Slide those over. Pardon me for holding the camera, but my tripod broke. Again, in a 1-6, I got this plate of food. It came with the egg, the steak, some garnish, a bottle of wine, and a glass of wine. And this whole thing was like $4. I think it's adorable. It's a true one six, so Barbie size. That was it for one six. Um, no, I'm lying. I also got this phone. So the thing is, I ended up with four of them because I didn't check my cart. So I would definitely, as a tip, check your cart before you check out because what could have been a $2 phone ended up being $8 uh, because I accidentally bought four. But I think this phone is perfect for Wednesday, size-wise. I might be making that up. Um, it's a 1.6, so it works. I should say, though, that some of this stuff was labeled as 112, so always check the dimensions. I didn't. Um, for example, when I was looking for dollhouse miniatures, I should have checked the dimensions on this. This is way too big for a Barbie, um, but it's perfect size for the Wednesday doll. Same thing with this. I think this is a violin. I know she plays the cello in the TV show, so we're gonna pretend it's a cello. It comes with this adorable bow. I think it's perfect and it's gonna look great in her house. But again, Check the dimensions because I saw this under the, when I searched 112 dollhouse miniatures, this is definitely not 112. Unless you're making it a cello, then who knows? Because isn't the cello bigger? All right, now let's get into the 112. I got this little fish tank. It was interesting because some of the reviews said they didn't like that the fish was on the bottom and it looked dead. I don't think this fish looks dead at all. I think the fish looks real. The thing is, is um, it is obviously on the bottom and it's filled with resin, but you, they had an option of a bowl or a tank. I think this would be, this could work in 112 or 16. 
here are some books. This was a dollar. I'm going to cover these with different like actual book titles, but they're so cute. They're True 112 and they look like books. Here's a doll cradle. This could potentially be 1.6 or 112. It's solid wood and no breakage. That's important because I feel like one of the hesitations I had about ordering was that things would come broken because I saw how the Tamu packages come because my friend ordered before me and I was like, oh no, these things will break. But nothing was broken in the order. That dollhouse crib was adorbs. I got this tea set. It is solid. And uh, it's true 112. I think it was like two bucks. It's so cute. I was so happy to find this. This is a shower head. I'm making a shower stall in one of my 112 houses. These are $15 and up on um, Etsy when I looked. But this was 99 cents on Temu. Another really cute thing I got was this little utensil stand. And every, all the utensils actually come off. True 112, less than $2. So cute. All right, let's see. What else did we get? These shipping boxes, these were a dollar and they are adorable. And they're actual like brands that you'll recognize. These are so cute. Who doesn't love little packages in their houses, right? Especially for like a Christmas house I'm making. I had an alarm clock, but I'm pretty sure because it was so tiny. I'm pretty sure it disappeared. Oh no, here it is. Here's the alarm clock. That's a true 112, but it would also work in a 124, like the Calico Critters houses. This is a little, like, suitcase. It actually opens up, and it looks, like, old-fashioned. I don't know why I just loved this. I thought it was so cute, and it was, like, two bucks. But definitely will use that in my Wednesday house. Here is a toy train. I thought this was so cute. I love putting little toys in like the children's rooms in my dollhouse. This could be a 112 or a 1.6. Um, it's so adorable. And again, it was like less than $2. That's it for the dollhouse things that I got. I also picked up this little cat. So again, this was something I found when searching for 112 dollhouse miniatures. This is huge. I was getting lazy when I ordered because I was tired. I did not read the dimensions. If I had, I would see that this obviously could not be used in a dollhouse. But look at it. It's so cute. I'll probably put it on my desk at work. This one I knew was not dollhouse size. This was only $4. But my son is obsessed with puppies and it had amazing reviews. I mean, four bucks. It is the softest, cutest thing in the world. Uh... It doesn't come up off the carpet thing, but for $4, it's adorable, and I think it's a cute little toy just to pet. Um, so, yeah, all of this stuff was $25. Oh, I forgot one more thing. I got two orders of wine bottles. These are the cutest wine bottles ever. The labels, and they were like two bucks. The labels, one cents like Montepulciano, Tamada. What is this? Chile. What does that say? I don't even know. Carmenere? Vino chileno? So, this is so cute. All of the li the labels are different. Um, I got two orders of those. I use those in a 112 house. So, that's my haul. If you are dollhousing, I definitely suggest going to Temo. I'm so happy that I am going to go back this time, take my time, and see what else they have to offer. Uh, definitely sign up for that 30% off coupon. Get your free shipping and happy dollhousing. Okay. Happy crafting.